you shot at defenseless people that were not aware of what was going on until they knew it was too late. Your actions were a gutless character of a person. There's nothing heroic about your shooting, about shooting people from behind and people not having a chance of defending themselves. I do not forgive you for what you have done. But while you are in prison, you will come to reality that you are now in hell and only the fire awaits you. Your father was a garbage man and you became trash of society. He is ashamed of your identity. You deserve to be buried in a landfill. This world was created with colour. A peasant like you will never change the human race. Your wish is to make this world a racist cult of one colour, but you will never succeed. I ask from you, your honour, that this scum of the world never be allowed to walk free from prison in his lifetime. To never be able to set an example for those who follow in his steps. I ask that he be put in mainstream prison and stop wasting taxpayer money on giving him special treatment and protection. And coming back to this maggot, I would like to say that my 71-year-old dad would have broke you in half if you challenged him to a fight. But you are weak. A sheep with a wolf's jacket on for only 10 minutes of your whole life. I'm strong. And you made me even stronger. May you get the severest punishment for your evil act in this life. And in the hereafter, we know that Allah is the most just. You transgressed and you thought you can break us. You failed miserably. We became more determined to hold tight to Islam and our beloved ones are martyrs. وَلَا تَحْسَبَنَّ الَّذِينَ قُتِلُوا فِي سَبِيلِ اللَّهِ أَمْوَاتًا بَلْ أَحْيَاءٌ عِنْدَ رَبِّهِمْ يُرْزَقُونَ Allah is gone, but never forgot him. He will always be the light of our lives. And we will live his legacy every day. Oh my Lord, honor Allah the way that he has dignified me and obeyed me in my old age. رَبِّ الْحَمْهُ كَمَا بَرَأَنِي كَبِيرًا